room. I came home with these four things and they were all $1.25 each. Um, <clears throat> so, you know, five bucks. Um, I also got makeup wipes, but that's more for just changing like my looks in between because what I wanted to do is say I only had a dollar and something. I'm going to do a makeup look with just one item at a time to show you that even if you only have like two dollars for makeup, you too can have some pretty nice looks. Um, because you know, we all deserve to feel pretty and like, don't get me started. No matter how much money we have, we deserve to feel pretty and have makeup if we so desire to wear makeup. You don't have to wear makeup, but I like to wear makeup because it's fun and it makes me feel pretty. Um, but yeah, and I'm gonna start with this one, which is just a, let's see, it's a LA Colors palette. Um, let's see, let's open it up. Okay, and I went with this palette. I mean, you can always go with your own choices of colors. I went with this palette because it's got a lot of bronzy colors. So if you wanted to contour and didn't have a contour palette, these could substitute. Um, they might not be as good substitutes because you know what I'm looking at them, they're a little glittery. But I mean, if you want a full glitter look, you do you. Um, but I also, these pinks I think will come in uh, very handy. And I really like this like soft blue a lot. Also these gray colors are really nice. Anyway, let's do a look with just this palette. I'm gonna clip up my hair so they don't interfere. Okay, let me show ya what you can do. Um, I'm gonna start with the darkest one right here. So I'm just gonna get a good amount on the brush. I have a mirror behind me. I'll show you this cool hack that I have always used. Say you don't have any eyeliner, you ran out of eyeliner, or <clears throat> God help us all, you don't have money for eyeliner. Um, eyeshadow, eyeshadow can be eyeliner. So what I, I'm gonna do is explain what I'm doing. I'm going to put eyeshadow around the lids of my eyes on the bottom. I still have a little bit of leftover makeup, I'm sorry. It's just mascara, I promise. <laughs> but, um, okay, so makeup on the eyeshadow on the lower lid. And there's one. I might go over it a second time just to get a little darker with my, my dark brown. Dark brown is perfect for eyeliner, I swear, because it looks kind of like a natural. So there's that. We got some, an eyeliner. And I think what I'm gonna do next is I'll just take more of this brown and put it on my top lids. I use this. Just to kind of give it like an even, dark look because I like to do dark eye makeup and that's just how I am. So you know it kind of looks a little more even. Um, and so I didn't get blending sponges because um, more recently I stopped using them because I thought about how wasteful they are. Not that it matters that much but like I realized I could blend with my hands and I think this is the perfect opportunity to show, <laughs> you know, you don't have to have sponges to do good blends. Um, but yeah, I usually just kind of go along. Like right now I'm gonna try to get it a little more um, soft, you know what I'm saying? I just do this to kind of, yeah, you know, blend it, make it a little softer, a little more, not as, your cut if you know what I'm trying to if you know picking up what I'm throwing down all right so there we have that with using just this so far um, and there's a little more I want to do with it I really like the reds 
and I don't know that everyone will like this as much as I do, but I do it like with my makeup looks all the time because I think it just makes my eyes pop. I really like it. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go along right here and just pack on that red. Let's see, let me get in the mirror. Like I was talking about earlier, this palette has like a glittery look to it. So I'm putting this red under my eyes, which it's not popping as much as it should because I guess it's just a cheap palette, but still you can, you can tell it's there. Um, I'm putting this red under my eye and I'm kind of using the red to um, blend the eyeliner a little bit too, but it's gonna give like this glittery look under my eyes. It's gonna look cool. Now I'm just gonna go in over this little area right here. See, it's not showing up as much on the camera, but you can see it more IRL. If I turn, you can kind of see how it's glittery. Um, <clears throat> now I'm gonna like do my little blend thing a little little glittery look to it. You can kind of see it. It's just not showing up well on the camera. Um, okay, and the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take this white right here, and I'm just going to use it to do some highlights. So, like, I'm going to put one right there. I'm going to put one right there. I always do one on my nose because I think it's really cute. And I like to do the little corners of the eye right here. And it looks so funny right now, but I promise you'll see. It looks wonderful. Just give me a second. With my hands, because you don't have to have a makeup sponge to do full blending tricks. That's the biggest hack of all, really. They're subtle, but they're there. You can kind of see them. And yeah, so this is the first look and <clears throat> you know it's simple it's nothing crazy but for a dollar 25 you know what i mean like here we are the look and i would wear this as like an everyday thing it's pretty it's simple it's nothing crazy and yeah dollar 25 the next look i'm going to show you is so crazy simple that you're gonna be like, no freaking way, no freaking way. And I do this look all the time when I'm just not really feeling like doing anything crazy, not feeling like putting any time on my makeup, but I still want like, you know, some makeup on. And um, yeah, it's just something I kind of picked up on my own from doing makeup as much as I've been doing it. Trying to make sure I get everything off so you can see it in its raw form. <laughs> I'm trying to adjust my glasses, but I don't have them. Um, move my hair so I look all funny. Um, okay. So this is what I'm gonna show you. $1.25. If you're ever so gosh darn broke, that all you can afford is a dollar twenty-five. I got you covered. I got you covered. Mascara. One simple, easy look. So I do this all the time. Right away. I am going to put a shite load of mascara. Let me actually show you what I do on the top. And what I do is I kind of like, I'll blink my eyes and then I'll like move it back and forth like this. And I'll just basically keep doing that until I have like a really thick, full um, look with the mascara, you know? Cause mascara is freaking swag and I like to put so much of it on. I just think it's so pretty. 
I like to make my eyelashes look as long as I possibly can. And personally, I can't do the fake eyelashes. I would if I could, but I can't. I can never get them on. And then I can never get them to stay on, so. Sadly, I can't do fake eyelashes. And they're so pretty. But this is the next best thing for me. Okay, so we got some lashes. And if you put it on, like, heavy enough, it almost looks like you have, like, a top line of eyeliner. Sorry about this, like, mountain zip more. Um, and the next thing that I will do with this is go along the bottom lid. But what I'm going to do, <clears throat> when I go along the bottom, I'm going to kind of scrape. <laughs> scrape is a bad word because it makes it sound painful, but it's not. Brush the the brush along my lid so it kind of gives this like eyeliner look. I'll show you. Like the brush is touching my bottom lid. This trick gets like a little messy and you have to um, clean it up a bit. But it's worth it for the end result. See what I mean? Like it's very messy at the moment. But. Bam! And look, that just looks like simple eyeliner. I'm gonna do that on the other side as well. An easy way of um, substituting eyeliner if you don't have any. And here we are. This is the, I could probably clean it up a little more, but you know, this is $1.25. And you still have a simple everyday look. For this last look, I'm just gonna kind of throw it together using the things that I have already used. Like, you know, I got the mascara on right now. Um, I'm gonna use a little bit of this palette, Dollar. And I'm gonna use one of these felt eyeliners just to give myself little wings um, and this look combined would be one dollar one dollar one dollar three seventy five three dollars and seventy five cents get this dang thing open i hope that this helps people who might not have a lot of money for makeup and or just might already have things like this in their collection that they can pick up little tips from Shake, shake. So I'm um, basically just drawing on a wing. It's not the most beautiful, it's not the most perfect, but it's a wing and it's there. And I'm gonna try to get the other one as even as possible. Wings. They're not perfect, are they? They're really not perfect, but they don't look bad. So I got my wings. Got my mascara, and I'm gonna use this palette to just gussy this look up a little bit, you know? Let's do something with it. Typically, I wouldn't do it in this order. <laughs> I'd put the wings on last. Actually, not even last. Uh, I'd put the wings on before the mascara and do the mascara last. Right now I'm just adding a little bit of brown under and kind of blending it in just to make it just a little bit darker or kind of tone, you know what I'm trying to say? I don't know the makeup um, <coughs> jargon very well. I just do what I do. And makeup is a form of art and I love art and I just kind of use techniques that are similar to my art. Add a little bit of this room on the nose, and then we'll all the highlight back area. It's kind of blushy looking. All right. Blend it. So here we are, balling on a budget. 
Um, the eyeliner is a little watery, so whenever you do your makeup with this eyeliner, if you do get this one, um, I mean, I recommend higher quality ones, but sometimes you gotta ball on a budget, you know? I recommend if you do use this one, to make sure your eyes aren't in that like really itchy watery because if your eyes are watery in the corners right here it will kind of smudge um but yeah this is the full look and this is like three dollars and 75 cents of makeup and this is an everyday look that you could do on the budget and i it's simple and honestly, I might just leave it on because <laughs> it's not bad. It's it's pretty. I like it. But yeah, I hope this video reaches someone who might need a tutorial like this. Or it might just be useful and give you some tips and tricks. Um, and show you that you don't have to spend a shitload of money to have a nice look. Um, but yeah, treat yourself. Drink water, stay hydrated. And... Thank you so much for watching my videos. I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.